Is so. it attacking me? Oh no! <laughs> it's kind of coming. Yeah. Star, Star Tune. Yeah. Star -tune. yeah. Star -tune. <laughs> Hello, Star Tuners! <laughs> hey guys, today is a super, super special day. As you know, Francisco runs his very own cartoon talent show. Star Tunes! <laughs> I was recently watching some of last year's Star Tune cartoons, and they all had a common theme. There was Jack the Rabbit, there was Duck Squatch, there was Soap Donkey, and all three of those things are animals. And Amanda, is an animal expert. Mm -hmm. So Kim and I asked her to bring in a few of the Earth's cutest creatures. That's pretty cool, huh? So Kim, yep. humans first. What adorable creature did you bring? I brought the absolutely cutest, totally adorable Burmese python. Huh? Huh? Oh my goodness. This is Buttercup. You sure that's, that's not just a giant mutant banana with fangs? Is this a giant no. banana with fangs? No. No, it's definitely a snake. They, uh, they don't eat dogs, do they? <laughs> no. <You're> okay. <laughs> All right. So what kind of things do they eat? Uh, so he would like to eat big rodents. Okay. Um, or maybe even something like a rabbit or a chicken. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, no. You hear that, Carl? <laughs> do not come to the office today. Does she have teeth? She actually does. Close to 100. A hundred teeth? That's a lot of teeth. That's a lot of money from the tooth fairy. <laughs> <laughs> Do snakes blink? That is a very good question. So no matter how long you stare at her, you would never win a staring contest. And that is because she doesn't have any eyelids. Well, I got news for you. Neither do I. <laughs> it's on, snake. Ready, set, staring competition. Okay, I would. I am not gonna win in this. I'm not gonna win. Yeah, I'm we getting a little freaked out we just uh, looking at that thing. I don't trust it. Hey, uh, Kim. Yeah. Just pulled out the old phone here. Did yeah. a little internet search. Okay. And apparently, these things eat small rodents and mammals. You're a mammal, aren't you, Kim? Uh, yeah. Yeah. I guess. I guess I am. Um, uh, Francisco. Um, what animal did you did you bring in? Well, hold on to your noses, folks, because I brought. The cutest creature in the world. These things eat bugs. Okay. They have sweet racing stripes. Oh no. And they smell like a pile of rotten gym socks. You didn't bring a skunk. Ladies and gentlemen. Oh no. Say hello to the North American Stripe Skunk. Oh my gosh. Francisco. Cute, eh? I have a very important meeting to go to. I can't get sprayed by a skunk. Aw, oh, Kim, don't be silly. Skunks only spray as a defense mechanism. So as long as there are, like, no sudden loud noises, like car horns, okay. or cell phones ringing, okay. or... Oh, uh, I have a confession to make. That uh, that wasn't the skunk. That was me. I had a bean burrito for breakfast. Francisco. Silent but deadly. Well, we'll see you next week when we draw this skunk and that snake <laughs> into our very own cartoon characters. Well, before we go, I just want to thank Amanda so much for bringing all these great animals for us. Well, you're very welcome. All right, we'll see you next week. Make sure to subscribe. Oh hey, as you may know, I host a super sick talent contest called Star Toon, where a bunch of cartoon characters compete to get their own TV show. So click subscribe for weekly updates on the contest and for details on how you can help me choose the winner. I am so excited that I am going to X. Your mother was a coat. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry, that was, that was really, that was